Hey guys, welcome back to Streaming Nerds and today I have a special tutorial for all of you guys out there and in this tutorial I'm gonna show you how you can give an amazing look to your Android box. Lots of times users have asked me, hey your Android box looks so cool, the interface is so cool, where did you buy it? Well, this is nothing special with the Android box, but this is special with the launcher. I downloaded this launcher from Play Store and I will exactly show you how you can download it and how you can install it on your Android box. And then you will have the same amazing look like I have or even you can change it. You can make it look different. And guys, before I go ahead, if you think that I'm creating useful videos for you guys, please hit the like button on this video and also do not forget to subscribe to my channel. So guys, let's get right into the tutorial. And as you can see right now, I'm on the main screen of my Android box and I have kept my icons that I frequently use like my YouTube, ES File Explorer, this. And here is a little taskbar that I have. So this look that I have on my Android box is the Microsoft Launcher. Yes guys, it is the Microsoft Launcher and you can download it from Play Store. Play Store is available in all Android boxes. So guys, let me show you how you can get this awesome launcher. So let me click on Play Store. And right now I am inside Play Store and in here I will search for Microsoft Launcher and now I will click OK and you can see it brings up all these options and in here we will go on the first option. So in here you will see the install option and you will click on install and then click on accept. So the Microsoft Launcher has been installed and after that you will click on open and it shows this welcome to Microsoft Launcher and at the bottom it shows get started click on get started and at the bottom right corner you can see there is the next option click on next and then you can either sign in with your Microsoft account or you can just skip it so I will just skip it for now so let me skip it and it's showing you are all set click on let's go and now you can see it is showing me use Microsoft Launcher as home click on always and now you can see that the Microsoft launcher has been applied and it has some apps by default here which we can change and I will show you how and you can see it also has a bar at the bottom and it also has some apps in it so now if I press the left arrow key on my remote it goes on to these cards which come up by default and in here you can see there are some useful cards in here it is showing us the day and the date so you can see it is showing the news from the Washington Post in here and we can add more cards if we want or we can delete the cards as well. So we can click it pin to new page or remove this card. So these cards are useful if you want to use that. A cool feature on this launcher and let me go back to the main screen now and I can just swipe this one to the left side and I come back to the main screen. And in here you can see there is the location. You can add your location and it will show the temperature and everything. And now let's go into our apps and let's see. So we are in our app drawer and all the apps are in here and you can see it looks really nice and they have been alphabetically categorized. On the right side you can see these alphabets. If you click on any one of them it will go to that section. So if I click on C, all the apps starting with the letter C have popped up on the top. And now let me go back to the main screen and if you want to remove any application from the home screen you just need to click on this and hold your click and now you can see it shows me all these options and I will just click on remove. So it has removed it from the home screen and I don't need this search here so I will click on this one and hold my click and then it gives me these options which is cancel and remove. So I'm going to remove this clicking on remove. And now if you want to place Kodi in here or if you want to place any other application you just need to go on to your apps and then I will go on to K here at the, at the right side clicking on K alphabet and in here you can see the Kodi is at the top. I will click on it and hold my click and it gives me all these options and I will click on add to home and I'm going to drag it to the other page where all my apps are so here it is I'm gonna place it here so likewise you can do with other apps so now let me show you the launcher settings in here and in here you can see there is accounts if you want to add your Microsoft account you can do that and there is backup and restore you can see here if you want to back up your home screen look you can back it up here and then you can later restore it like if you want to factory reset your Android box you can first back up your look and then you can factory reset your Android box and then again when you install the Microsoft 
launcher you can come in here and you can restore the old look isn't that cool that is really cool and now we'll try to change the wallpaper and this option I do like a lot because it gives a new look uh, to the Android box so I will click on this and you can see it brings up all the new wallpapers from Bing so let's try this one out let me download it you can see the arrow and it, it is showing download finished so if I click on this one now it will open it and then you get the option to set it as a wallpaper so I will set it it's working right now so you can see there's a tick check mark which means that this wallpaper has been applied to our home screen so now if I go back to the home screen I'm pressing the home button on my remote and you can see how awesome the interface looks so what are you waiting for go ahead and give your Android box a new refreshing look and guys if you like the video please do share it with your friends and I'll be back with more awesome videos so stay tuned to my channel and I love you all bye bye